Hello. <laughs> what the beep was that? <laughs> My phone just fell off the table. This has not been a good start. Hello there. Okay, that's better. How are you doing today, you lovely human? Good? That's what I like to hear. I guess this is episode two of Talking Points, and today's Talking Point comes in from one of my favorite humans, Eshal, who runs Reese Pickles Fan, which is a fan page. Let's start off with the fashion industry, which is my chosen industry of work. And today I had to take some Polaroids for a client because I haven't had any Polaroids since I was in New York. So the most recent ones I had were about two or three weeks ago. And to that, you might say, Reese, you can't change that much in two weeks, can you? And to that, I tell you, I agree. I agree completely. But that's all part of the game. You need to stay in there and take pictures of yourself fairly frequently. And these Polaroids that I send to clients are somehow completely different from the Instagram posts I put up every day. So you literally get to see what I look like every passing day. Also on top of this, sometimes I need to send clients a video of me talking to the camera exactly like this, just saying my name, my age, my NC, where I'm from, some of the things I enjoy just so they can get a gauge of my personality. And these videos I send to clients are of course amazingly different from these YouTube videos I do where I express no personality. I'm very dull. Anyway, this is what taking Polaroids in my house with very limited good lighting other than this one light, which looks good in videos, but not in pictures, looks like. Mm. Here is the Polaroid taker. Hello. <laughs> As you can see here, I'm working it real good and I'm hitting all of those angles. Yep, there's a signature pose right there. We've never seen that one before as well. I could try and make a video to teach some of you just some of these techniques I'm using in that example there. However, it is very dangerous, very dangerous. Once a guy came up to me and he was just asking me over and over again, teach me this pose, teach me this pose. So I, ta I taught him one of, just one of my lower level poses, one of the easy ones, and he actually sprained his neck here, trying to, trying to hit the pose. And yeah, he just, he had to go to the hospital. He was wearing a neck brace for, for two months, it, was a, it really was a tragedy. And I've learned from that lesson to, I need to start even lower teaching some of the more basic poses because the, the advanced ones that I'm doing, it, they can land you in hospital quite easily. Food. I could personally make a whole short movie purely around food and the food that I enjoy. Food is good. Food tastes, looks, is food. The reason I chose this topic today is because last night I had a pizza and I am very passionate about this exact pizza. And this certain pizza was the creation of my sister, Laura. You see, and when she first told me about this exact pizza, I thought she was a monster. I'm gonna try and reenact my exact reaction when she first told me about the pizza for you here today. But, but barbecue base? No. Barbecue base and pepperoni? No, no. You, you idiot. You idiot. You see, personally, I am not a barbecue base man. You can see by the way I carry myself. I'm just not a barbecue base man. You can see, you can see it, it's plain as, plain as day. You can see it, no, not a barbecue base man. But the barbecue base on this pizza is just so downplayed, it's so subtle, so perfect. This pizza has changed my life for the better. I'm in doughy heaven, cheesy heaven. 
when I eat the pizza. Not right now. Now I'm sad that I'm not eating the pizza. Everyone that has come to visit me in my house, I force them to eat the pizza. I will force feed them a pizza and they never regret it. Unfortunately for most of you, where I get the pizza, it's a, fair, it's a fairly regional shop. It's just like a local pizza shop, so. Don't know what to say. Come to Middlesbrough, give it a try. Anyway, thanks for watching this episode of Talking Points. Bow, 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 bow. Bow, bow, woo. The outro is getting better, I can feel it. Silliness aside, I hope you have a lovely day and I will see you next time. Mate.